On Utah's Capitol Hill, lawmakers are finalizing their plans for passing tax cuts. Yeah, now that includes cuts to the income tax, the Social Security tax, and the food tax. Daniel Woodruff live at the Capitol with the very latest. Daniel? Well, Mark and Heidi, what's happened now in these final days of the session is that lawmakers have taken all of their plans for cutting taxes and they've folded them into one big bill that's just awaiting a vote here in the Utah Senate. That is House Bill 54. It would do several things. It would cut the income tax rate. It would also expand the Social Security tax credit for seniors and the earned income tax credit for low-income earners. Plus, it would double the child tax credit for the year that a child is born. Now, the bill would also also remove the, the food tax if voters approve of changing the state constitution in 2024. Leaders in the House and Senate have said that is necessary in order to make sure that other needs in the state have enough money if the food tax were to go away. Representative Judy Rohner has led the charge on getting rid of the food tax. Her bill on this issue isn't moving forward anymore because of this bigger bill, but she's glad that the issue is proceeding and she hopes that ultimately voters will get to decide. That's the most important thing. That's a victory, because the people are the most important thing. They are the ones that should decide. Not me, it should be the people. So again, this is a major tax cut bill now moving forward here in the Utah legislative session. In the final days of it, the session ends here on Capitol Hill on Friday. Live, Daniel Woodruff, KUTV, 2 News.